Hey everyone, this is Digital Davinji. So, if you are working with 3ds Max and trying to import animated files into DFI render, you know, using the .abc files, you might have run into frustrating problems like DFI either crashing, hanging, or just simply refusing to load. So, today I got a simple and effective solution for you. So, as usual, here is your car in 3ds Max, just like I have here. So. There are plenty of YouTube, YouTube tutorials out there on how to do this, so I won't go into much detail here. Once your animation is set up, we export it as an .abc file. Okay, just go to File, Export, and then save as type as .abc and just save somewhere. Okay, so, th so this is where the problem starts actually. You know, when you try to import this .abc files onto D5 render, D5 is either crashes or hangs. Okay. So the fix is actually simple. We need Blender. So Blender is actually free and you know easy to use software. Not not so easy to use, but very what can I say? It's a free software. So you just need to use it as a bridge in between D5 and 3ds Max. So just inst install Blender. It's actually free and open source. Install Blender, open it, and then this will be the interface right here. Just drag, select, and delete the cube. Okay, you don't need it. Then just import our .abc file that you just saved from the DS Max. Just import the .abc file using this file option. Find your .abc file and just import it. Okay. So let me just find mine. Okay. So we have it here. So this is the DS Max .abc file. Okay. I am just importing it. After import is complete, just don't do anything. Just go to export and file. Then export it back as a .abc file again. Okay, don't, you don't have to do anything at all in Blender. That's why I said you don't need to know nothing about Blender. Just just need to install it, open that file, then export it again. That's it. So once you export it back, and this export it somewhere. Downloads. Then I will just say test Blender. Let's like that no need to do anything right here okay and then export the file it will take some time to export okay after the export is completed open d5 render okay you need to open d5 then use the import option import option and just find your blender file okay see this is the blender file i have already imported uh, the blender file from blender okay so i'm just going to use it or we can wait while the export is completed actually yeah, just, yeah, let's wait so once the export is completed just go to d5 go to import and then yeah, you can find the file here test blender ok then just open it and we can see right here that it's loading so fast without any problem so one thing that you need to keep in mind is that when we import this 3ds max file that is the this dot abc files it actually fails to carry over the material or text information in the fire render so we will need to reapply manually apply the materials again as also we need to precise our model as well as you can see our model model is actually small so we just need to resize it here and then you will be good to go animation is somewhere out there okay there it is so you need to resize it as well as apply the text textures again oh it actually resized into a jumbo car okay don't need that much now you can just use the material picker tool to you know add the materials once again just do that you will be good to go okay and I have actually animated a car and imported it right here. So just you can just watch that video right here. This is proof that this technique works. So that's all about the video. And if you have any doubt, go into the comment section and let me know what you want to learn more about from this. Okay. Thank you.